Guys, we're live, by the way. Uh, welcome to Ballroom Backstage. Hi. It's a consecutive second week. We are in January. We are doing those live, those live broadcasts starting the year on a very cheer note. We have a lots of great guests. Uh, last last week we had Wayne Eng and Anna Shabazian. We were talking about the uh, upcoming City Lights uh, open in San Jose, California, which is going to happen next week, 24th to 27th of January. And Wayne Eng uh, with his Emerald Ball Dance Sport Championships and 30 years, uh, 30th year anniversary. And today we have, uh, I would call them very extravagant couple who has made a big impression on me with smooth and with their sh social media postings, and especially with this uh, water dance challenge. Uh, Maxi Nitz and Tatiana Silvestro, guys, uh, thank you for coming. They, thank you uh, for having us. Yeah, so question is, what is water, this water challenge? Is w dance, no, dance with the water challenge, first of all, because I just saw it from you. I never saw you, t you told me there was original video with Nazar Norov uh, and, and Irina, and I never saw it. So mm. I didn't do my due diligence. So uh, what it's all about? It was started by Wei Neng, and he basically had dancers dance with two cups of water or a cup of water. Just water was involved, and you couldn't spill it. So okay. he just challenged. He, he nominated students. us and students or anyone. He nominated a few other people to do the same thing. Okay. And so he started it. He started yeah. it. Wayne, okay. And uh, we decided to take it uh, to the next level. <laughs> All right. All right. So uh, main thing. So this is a video. Hold on, guys. So this. So this is a video. First, uh, the first thing. Boom! Right here with that chair. So That's how right. how many times did you try it, and how many times did she fell? Uh, did she fall? <laughs> I actually didn't. Uh, Fell on the floor. It hit me a couple of times. Okay, so I'm mm. sorry. I lost my voice today. Yes, we have to. Um, we have to explain uh, what happened with your voice. What happened? Nothing happened. <laughs> <laughs> Life <laughs> happened. Life just <laughs> lost. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So I would be talking less, unfortunately. Fine. Usually, Fine. I don't allow him to talk, but today. You have my all time. the privilege. It's my time uh, to discuss. Um, right. I, s <laughs> I was sliding that chair probably about at least six, seven times until until we got the distance right. How much the floor s was allowing the chair to slide? It was like I don't know. The hand was always. The hand <laughs> was in the shot. In the shot. So the hand was in. Uh, so yeah. well, when I slid the chair. My my idea was okay. Is that you pushed it with your with your leg? No. That's not no. my idea. No, that Bam. would be cool, but no. No. No, I did I it love with my this. hand. I love this. Oh. But it was <laughs> just something that uh, Tatiana had an idea that uh, that she wanted things to happen, okay. you know, kind of separately from separate shots. And uh, w that's what we did. All right. So how, w mm. how w okay, knowing you guys, you're very, very, very creative. And I know, and I see you, and uh, you don't change your routines much, but they do change your style change. And from competition to competition, I see you in different mood. And sometimes she's very, uh, she's very like a butterfly. Sometimes very, you know, very, I would say, in in the zone. And uh, how did you guys agreed on the one version of the, of that video? Because I know you probably created like twenty five of them. We talked about a few versions, yeah. but I think Tatiana ended up having a clear idea of what she wanted to do. That's uh. kind of how it works in our dancing. If there's a clear idea that when, one of us, when is this a that, clear that idea one of us for has. you? When, when when this moment when you have she a clear idea a when i see his eyes going like that and then like okay i need to explain in more details because he's like distance is getting bigger and bigger and then once i give the details and okay. i get so excited he goes okay let's do it <laughs> Done right, deal. she just had a particular thing she, she had the look in her mind she had the chair and the wine and the glass and all that. So, so okay, uh, uh, which different ideas you had prior to this one? So originally, uh, we wanted to make it more casual because uh, we usually practice in the morning. I wanted uh, to put the ropes on uh, with a <laughs> cup of coffee or tea. And then we realized that the glass is not see-through, so nobody's going to see it. And uh, he goes, why don't we use glass for, of wine? And I'm like, in the morning. <laughs> Nobody knows. Okay, I didn't know that this was morning. Okay. Right. <laughs> right. Um, so we thought about it, and we decided, let's try it first to dance with the glass. Okay. Before we even do anything. Right. <clears throat> uh -huh. So I gave him a homework. I'm like, you go home, you check at home, if you can find the glass, and you can 
do something with it. And then suddenly something hit me and I have this song in my head. I close my eyes and I see how I want this video to look like. That it's a cocktail dress, casual shoes, wine, and a certain shot edited how he's offering me some wine and then how we dance with it and how we change between us. Okay, so, so I call him right away. Next day, we filmed it. Okay, you told me there was like hour, you filmed it, it was very quick, it was hour, uh, hour and a half, yeah. right? So how was the, how was the, uh, how you actually filmed it? So uh, you told me that your friend helped you out. I'm, I'm very jealous you didn't call me, by the way. So uh, your, friend, your friend helped you out. Uh, so tell me all the details. By the way, we'll keep you, uh, you know, in mind. Yeah, for thank you very much. We actually, yeah, recordings. we discussed it. <laughs> I said, we, we have two we options. Yeah. We either call my friend or Dima. Okay. Who lives closer, basically? Right, <laughs> right. So anyway, okay, so what the deal? So, because I see there's like, I, I can see there's like cuts and there's like different shots and uh, l like and everything. Tell me more, tell me more, more details. Because you told me when you practice, you covered the floor uh, uh, with a film, oh. with, a, with a plastic, so well, if right? We, if you look here carefully, uh, there is a spot. <laughs> that wine, <laughs> w the wine has already spilled. You can clearly <laughs> see it. Most of you didn't pay attention to that, but we had spilled wine. Uh, I spilled wine um, when I was changing from one hand to another, the glass going yeah. from one hand, and of course it slipped. And I caught the glass, but of course I caught <laughs> it sideways. It spilled on my <laughs> shirt, so uh, when I had to clean it up. It spilled on her and on the floor. Good so, okay. thing we were wearing We black. see that the bottle is almost empty, so how many bottles of wine Well, we wasted used? one glass that spilled, and okay. then we had to add more. After and <laughs> then we realized that we have no more options <laughs> left. We have to like make this right, because I have next, no more wine left. And next shot would be 7-Up. You know? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, um, <coughs> so it, it, we did spill it. Okay, and uh, the choreography you said, that's pri primarily a foxtrot, but you have to fit it into, into the movie and, and mm -hmm. all that, right? So. We added How much did you do? A little bit of tango there at the end, because it's more stationary. Okay. We didn't want to move that much. Okay. We're professional, but not to the extreme that we can literally dance the whole routine <laughs> with a glass of wine. Okay. Uh, so, um, and we had to fit it in uh, one minute. Mm -hmm. I didn't want it to be longer than one minute. Yeah, it's, uh, it's And cool. actually, uh, because we were running out of wine, we added a little bit of water there. And the last shot we've been filming, I. It was actually the one where I was drinking, and I forgot that it was water inside of, and it was not the drinking water. So you should have seen my face on the first shot when I tried that glass. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, not that excited, but. <laughs> you mentioned you want to start your own, your own dance challenge too. Is it? Yeah. Is it still serious? We would definitely will. Okay. Yeah. What what's going to be the names? Dancing with slippers or something? Uh, that I don't know. we're not going to reveal, but we're definitely talking okay. about uh, doing it sometime soon. So you have to stay tuned, and it's going to be uh, fun and difficult, but you know uh, that's what the challenge is. All right. I mean, uh, you guys have you 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 guys are very creative, and uh, this is like something. I always can always can give you always surprise me and uh, it's the, the the video already has what you said more than ten thousand view yeah. views just yeah. on Facebook yeah. and it's pretty it's it's pretty cool for ballroom world is like insane so love it uh, okay uh, another another part so you starting to do those cliff notes uh, of smooth yes. uh, I watched one with with the coin was pretty interesting uh, yeah who is it, who was e who was initiator of the, of that? Uh, Take a wild guess. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. Oh, all right. Um, <coughs> idea. So, how often will you do those? Once a week. We, yeah, we do them. We try to do them once a week. Not exactly at the same time of the week, but once a week there will be a video. All right. Uh, is is going to be anything beside that? Is it going to be how to put your uh, socks for the competition? Uh, one minute, l one minute video from Max <laughs> per se. Uh, is <coughs> it going to be? It's possible. You never know. It depends what would be in demand. Right. So if we get requests from people asking for okay. certain things, I think we will do it. Of course. All right. Uh, yeah, and I know you just recently shot the uh, your video. Uh, 
educate instructional video with Wayne Eng, right, right, for Dance Vision. So That's can right. you tell more um, more about it? Then we'll, we'll come back to you. Uh, your we went to notes. Vegas for a few days. Shot uh, for Wayne. Did uh, a lot of detailed videos on the bronze technique okay. in the American style. And uh, it actually was uh, a great experience for us. We both started a little bit slow, and then, uh, like the second day, we just everything was one shot. So every video was one shot. We felt comfortable, and it was just a great experience. And uh, it was just so. A it's great a. Time. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm. I miss it. It's a syllabus or technique. Technique. It was technique. Technique. Okay. Uh, all all dances. All dances. All seven. Well, there was a part uh, dedicated for my ladies, uh, okay. a lot of arm styling turns. Okay. So it's, it was a lot about the stylization of dancing. Right. Okay. And on top of that, each dance. Did, did Max, did, did you do any st styling for the, for the guys? I didn't do I don't styling. Know. I, did, I did some... How did to some use a... I had, some, I had some videos that I did on my own. Uh, there was a few videos that Tatiana was not part of, and okay. she, of course, had her own set that she did on her own as well. So she needs to have her own set. I of mean, course, yeah, of course. Like, uh, you know, she has a lot to say. So. I'm surprised that Wayne didn't build uh, her own studio for her. It's so <laughs> not out of the question. He did. Wayne. We did. we actually okay. were in the new studio. We were in the new studio recording it. Yeah. Congratulations. <laughs> That's right. Okay. But okay. please yeah. subscribe, guys. It's um, a lot of good information. That's right. Go into dancevision.com. And please watch us. You will love it. And come back to your cliff. Come back uh, quickly to your cliff notes. So, how many did, did you do so far? Three. Three, and another one is coming up what's this week. Uh, what? Okay. What's the next one is all about? You can reveal it now. I mean, come on. True. Uh, it's uh, gonna be about opening in and out okay. from the partner in the Foxtrot, okay. in the Venus Walls. So it's a common step in basically. Okay. Dances. And they and they actually both on your Facebook and your <coughs> uh, and your <coughs> and, uh, and, your and, your and your Instagram, right? Correct. Okay. Actually, I have a personal question. So, as we know, ballroom dancing is very is is very is very conservative, and we know that you guys not conservative in your dance style and your approach and create creativity at mm -hmm. all, and it all resonates with what you do on social media as well. Okay. Uh, so, how come you're so different? Why? That's that's my personal. What makes wow. you so different? <coughs> like, how come that the whole majority of our ballroom dancing is so conservative, and you guys so like out of like <coughs> out of the blue? That's a good question. Moving on. No, no. <laughs> I think I think, uh, I think part of it is personality. Okay. Our personal personalities, our, yeah. our our characters. We do want to be different in the right way. <coughs> okay. We want to be original. Okay. And for me. Um, I am from a very small country. Okay. And Still bigger uh, than mine, so I want <laughs> I want uh, I want to leave something behind myself. Uh -huh. I want people Are you uh, going are you going away somewhere? Hold on. No no no, <laughs> no no no. I'm just saying so that I wanna uh, give the industry something important. Mm -hmm. I wanna dedicate since I already dedicated my life towards dancing, yeah. I uh, would like um, to leave my mark, mark, yes, mark. Um, and uh, this is what basically ha is happening. And uh, I feel that uh, today, as of today, we have a uh, big influence on smooth, and big, uh, yes. we finally uh, find our, I would say, balance between creativity, technical part, uh, communication. Uh, partnering and uh, this is the time where we can uh, reveal the product and we can um, show it to you in the best possible way and uh, you guys travel quite a bit uh, right now or, uh, around uh, around the world with smooth too so I believe you've been in Europe a couple of times right have you been in China I'm uh, I missed we that did one. a show mm -hmm. you did only shows we did you a never show competed in China, there. correct okay. No. okay so how it is uh, so we know how it it's received here it's it's big from beginning of the time so how it is starting there uh, on on the other side so how it is how it is developing is it developing perception of okay this is mixture between Latin and standard or it is entirely different thing, and how can you inc how <laughs> can you influence that? It definitely um, not comparable in the 
average of people doing it mm -hmm. yet. Uh, and they have no expectations. All right. So they basically, you feed them mm -hmm. and they eat everything you give them. So it's very important to give the basic, the very basic things, mm -hmm. the, how the body works, the correct footwork, because it's very easy for them to go into the routines and start create their own thing. So uh, therefore, we actually decided to start those cliff notes so people can learn uh, the very basic things and apply it to their routines. That actually gave us that idea. <coughs> How did you guys decide what will be a next cliff note besides that the people are writing you? Because that's again, Max will think one thing, I know for sure, Tatiana will think another <laughs> thing, and then you well, have to, we we have we to battle Well, we usually keep, sometimes we keep both ideas, we just choose which one we're going to shoot this week, and now we already have another idea for next week. Mm -hmm. So we, we already discussed at least a few options, we just chose mm -hmm. one for, for next week. Most of it comes from the common mistakes from <laughs> our students. Ah, uh -huh, okay. <laughs> well, yeah, we, we both kind of talk about... You're tired to explain it on every lesson. Okay, I'm just going to make a video, guys. <laughs> yes. And I'm going to yeah. send it out no to names. you. And don't you dare not <laughs> to watch it, because this is too much by now. Right. Okay. And we travel and we coach and we also, you know, we, we see what are the common general errors. All right. So. Okay. And, and uh, is mu how much, pe what people ask the most, by the way? So what, uh, what, what the biggest, for what, what questions do they ask you the what most? What is on demand? Yeah. What do you what think? What's in your What's in your opinion? They want to. I mean, they want to see a basic combination in a dance, meaning choreography. Okay, the more choreography than actually technique. Some, yeah, some ask for choreography. Just okay. you know, just do a section mm -hmm. together, please, with music. So, you know, they can either use that piece or they can see how it transitions. All right. Other people would love to see much more detailed uh, uh, explanation of something. Mm -hmm. I usually get couples who ask me to work on dynamic changes. Okay. And you, you are very dynamical, yes. And you all are of that. And then they find out I'm very technical. Damn <laughs> 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 yeah, it, what did I sign up for? <laughs> okay. Uh, and uh, upcoming season, right? Just last last couple of uh, uh, small questions. So up, upcoming, upcoming season, season, I know. Uh, did you plan? I mean, I'm sure you planned out all already, right? So Yeah, the year is planned. Okay. Uh, how many comes this year? Is didn't it is count. It gonna, didn't count. Is, gonna, is it going to be a record for you? Mm. No. No. Okay. I think the first no. year was the record. Yeah. yeah. It's been we everywhere. We don't even know what the amount was, but it felt like it was almost every weekend somewhere. So why did you decide to do less than than the other years, or I mean, or the same, or what's what determine the amount of competitions? Well, we we are currently booked quite a bit for shows. Okay. We have to leave time for that. Uh -huh. for coachings out of town so competitions are are also there but all that put together keeps us busy how different for you right now i asked that question before on some interviews and i'm curious how different for you the show and and the competition oh you still i love dancing. shows <laughs> the most <laughs> okay i put so much into the shows but i can't wait to perform it again actually <laughs> i think if we, uh, we we tend to basically do the competition like a show and i think it works well for us Competition like mm. a show. Yeah, oh, yes, meaning, it does. meaning we, it you does. know, we're not. Um, we, okay, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. But okay, Tanya. So, is Max is the same during a show and during a competition? Uh, mood wise, yes, or mood wise, and uh, because we all can describe Max only only one way at the smooth. The, this, that's it. That's it. Uh, so, I think this. he he, <laughs> he has definitely more expressions in the show. Because we have a storyline about <laughs> love <laughs> and how love develops okay. through the dances. And, uh, and you don't I bring actually, you don't bring I didn't realize that until I saw it once on a video, because uh, the intro is uh, him just walking on the floor for about a minute and giving audience this atmosphere of old Paris and him said, do do that, and then you I'm the like, wow, he's quite a good script. actor. He is a good actor, but how do you do that? So what do you, uh, what you well, do it's then? everything. It's Besides uh, it's the croissants hat, and coffee. It's, it's the cigarette that I have. It's it's the trench coat, the rain, the, mu the sound of the rain recorded in, okay. the, in the music. Uh, all of that, uh, the speech that is recorded on top of that, all that brings a certain mood, and we set that up for the show. Okay. Hmm. Um, and our show is nonstop, you know, 18 minutes. But before you did one show, right, which was even bigger, uh, right? It, it is oh, physically mm, challenging. Yeah. yeah, yeah, we experimented, of course, and we, at this point, uh, we have uh, 
uh, one version of it, and we will keep working on enhancing it and ultimately. Yeah. I give you the kudos, guys. You always exper experimenting. Like yeah, and it's, it's not always. Talk, you know, but it's so not always goes uh, in a good way. That's why it's experimenting. So you know, you have to find out. We what pay. What we what pay for it, but. But we we then come up with something that works, and if we didn't have something that didn't work, we would know what works. You know? Max, who is more experimenting in your couple? Experimenting? Yes. With our dancing? Yes. Uh, <laughs> I th uh, probably the desire to experiment would be more her. But I think he actually experiments more. But I think I, p I, p I probably prefer to push the boundaries myself more. Because for boundaries me it's a what? normal thing to, oh, let's just do, let's just put this song on and just dance. For him to really it's do to it, sense. It, it's, it's a challenge for him. Like, what do you mean? I, do you I, mean by I don't know. Okay. I learned. I learned that uh, it it's could be a little bit dangerous to go too much outside the box. Okay. I like going outside the box. And what do you mean by dangerous? Result-wise? No. Uh, uh, opinion-wise no, of opinion other people. Opinion-wise, it could be also result-wise. I mean, we 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 had our fair share of. Of know, course, yeah, like yeah. like all uh, of our us. road was going. Yeah, and I and it was fun. It was great. I mean, but we I had think a great that's time. What's <laughs> that's what <laughs> makes. Uh, that's I think what makes your successes too. Right, you know, because you never, I, I never know when I film you where I have to point a camera. It's always difficult. I know maybe, maybe right. they're gonna go this way. You know, like for <laughs> example, we had a moment in uh, uh, at USDC um, where uh, I flipped my jacket inside out. I don't know if you remember that. Yeah, I do remember that, and I it was during Hollywood as well last year. Uh, From, yeah. From uh, <laughs> we did an interview actually, and then you switched it, and right. I was wondering how 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 did you do that? Right. Anyway, something like uh -huh. that. Uh, I, I like doing things like that because uh, it, it's it's unexpected, um, and it usually wouldn't come from me. It seems like actually it would be something that maybe would come from Tatiana, but actually it's not. So <laughs> <laughs> clarifying on the video, it's uh, not from Tatiana. Everything, guys. But, so don't but there is don't, the right don't don't call her too much, okay? <laughs> so it's not from her. <laughs> there is a right time for those things, and you know there's a right time for other things. So okay. What's for you the boundaries in this case? The boundaries, I think, uh, the... Is it worth it? Y the r yeah, is the risk worth the effect? Okay. Yeah. You know what I mean? The yes. If, the if, yeah, if, yeah, the if, I, if it's I worth do. the effect, then yes. What effect in general are you looking for in your performance? Because as much as I can see as a viewer and as a person who films you every time on the competition, I can see that the effect you, you're looking for is like, that's different. Yeah. That's, <coughs> that's my think, perception. I think we, we went from the road of trying to be different and we took it too much aside. <coughs> for example, LED lights during the last Ohio didn't work out as well. I haven't seen that, sorry. <coughs> so my, my dress uh, basically let up uh, during the last dance and it was remote controlled. So unfortunately, it took us, it took attention away from dancing. Okay. And by, by the end of the day, we're on the floor to present good quality dancing. So um, now we're looking for the effect which we can create by combining certain look with the quality. And this is where is the right spot. This is the boundaries for us now. We experiment, but we experiment with our dancing rather than all the external, external things. Now my brain is leaking out, out, out of my ears. Ladies and gentlemen, Maxinitsa and Tatiana Silverst over here today, so you can please sign up for their Cliff Notes. Uh, you can watch their amazing videos on Dance Vision. Uh, yep. Wayne, Wayne, uh, new videos are coming up as well. Yeah, new videos are coming up regarding our schedule. So next week, guys, don't forget to watch on Facebook Ballroom Backstage. Don't forget to watch uh, City Lights open in San Jose. And then a couple of weeks later, we are flying to Florida Superstars. And it's come, It's uh, this year, it's in Orlando. So don't miss that, and uh, much more videos coming up with, wi with those two. Thank you for watching. Goodbye. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Wow, you didn't talk enough. I have to. <laughs> okay. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. I was still alive. Mom, hi. <laughs> okay.
Ходим, ходим, ходим.